just about ready to roll here. Starting on the mound in this one, number 27. What do we have on him? Well, he got into the eighth inning his last time out, really pitching deep in the games as of late. We'll see today how many innings he's got in him. Michael Evans in the box with two gone and takes a look at a called strike. Lifted in the air out to left. Puts the squeeze on that one, and that'll end the inning. Back here at the ballpark, here's the second baseman, Michael Evans. Time asked for it to plate, and he gets it. And here it comes. That one finds the zone. Strike one. Good eye right there. And the pitch. Ah, that hit him. And the leadoff man is aboard to start the inning. Boo, do you uh, have any memorable hit by pitches yourself? Maybe high school, college? No, but I almost did get decapitated by a foul ball at Old Tiger Stadium. Line drive, base hit. Lead runner around second. And now runners at the corners, nobody out. Off the bat, it was headed for the gap all the way. And as a hitter, you love seeing those as you take your first couple of steps out of the box. You know you've got some real estate to run on. It's such a good feeling. Nice liner into the gap right there. Runner in scoring position now and a good opportunity to push across the first. Ground ball left side could be two. Keenan over to second and a run scores on the double play. Here's the catcher, Jamie Ritchie. Back to the mound, it hit him. On the run, sends it over to first. Barely got it for the out close play. The comebacker got him. Welcome back, new inning getting started. And now it's the switch inning second baseman, Michael Evans. That one clips the outside corner. It's 0-1. Evans, only 18 years old, and he was a third-round pick in 2023. All right, now, he may have not liked either of those first two pitches or agreed with the umpire's calls, but at this point, he's going to have to bear down and be ready to hit anything close to the zone. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. And the pitch. On the ground, right side. Sends it to first. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. Ready to begin the eighth. Now it's the second baseman, Michael Evans. The pitch. Now here's a flare off the bat. Makes the catch. One down. So two down. And now Jamie Ritchie. One for three. And it's second. And he grounds one to the right side. Evans. And that is the inning. So no runs here in a big... The final line score for Adam Baldwin. For the victorious discipline, four runs on 10 hits. One error as they left 13 minutes. Here is Michael Evans. Sat out last night's game, but back in there today. And that's in there for strike one. And the pitch is outside, ball one. And he deals. In the air, fairly deep to right field. Snags it on the run. And that is that. And now the first baseman, number 12. Ball to strike. The pitch. On the ground, right side. Tosses to first. Now two away. 
batting third. So two on, but two away. Now here is Michael Evans. He's over one. That one's in there, 0 1. Second and third, two down. Hit hard on the ground to short. Third out, and that ends the frame. One run in the inning, but they leap. First and second, no outs. Here's the left fielder, Ernie Clement. On the ground, two ball. To second, there's one. On to Smith, two. And welcome back. And the batter now, Michael Evans. Michael Evans. The pitch. Swing and a hard hit liner up the middle to base hit. Man aboard on the leadoff single. First pitch swing in, went up there with the plan to be aggressive. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. TJ White getting ready to hit. The 1 Bounce to the right. Fires the second for one. Over to first, safe. Well, that was going to be a really tough one to turn two on, so a nice job to get the out at second right there. Hold on to the baseball. Shortstop clearly paid the price, but that kind of comes with the territory. No outs. Runner at first. Now it's the right fielder, number 54. Righty delivers. Grounder might be two. There's one. Not in time at first. It's a fielder's choice. One down. Michael Evans will hit next. Good swing out of him last time. Ripped a liner in the center. First pitch doesn't find the zone. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. Swing and a ball popped up. Great effort on a leaping grab. No outs. Runner at first. And now the DH, Leo Jimenez. Ground ball could be two. Feeds to second, out there. On to Smith, two. Got what he was looking for on the mound. Back here at the ballpark, and now the catcher comes up to him. Zach Britton. Kicks and fires. Bounced up the middle. Evans. Fires the first on the run. Throw is low, and he can't pick it. Well, this was a tightly played game. Got a little of everything. Some timely hitting. Runs on the board. Key pitching and defense in certain spots. Definitely a fun one to watch. A 5-3 final score in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, Thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon. Second inning set to go. And now, Michael Evans. Michael Evans. The pitch. That misses the zone. Ball one. And that's outside. The line of the pitch. He swings and hits a fly ball, center field. Cook hauls it in, and there's one away. Man in scoring position with two away. Here's the second baseman, Michael Evans. Yeah, he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. Threw that fastball right by him, slightly elevated. That's a confidence boost for this guy out there on the mound. See if he continues to climb the ladder. That one fouled off. Hey, let it rip. One 
0-2 now. Swing and a miss. Pulled the string of the changeup. Stepping in, Ernie Clement. 3-1 is on the way. In the air on the infield, Evans should have this one. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. One hit in the inning. Michael Evans digs in now. Line to right, and that'll be a base hit. He needed out one. It's been a tough stretch to play lately. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball. He let it get deep, took the barrel right to it, and then extended through the swing for the line drive base hit. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Derek Hill, the next to hit. He's over one. 3 2. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Pretty good spot on the outside, but just couldn't quite clip the zone. That's a stone-cold take. Here's Carter Kibu, one for two. Hit weakly on the ground. Britton. A flip to the pitcher covering. That ends the frame. No runs, a hit. Back to the top of the lineup. Here's the center fielder, Zach Cook. And a sack bun here. Smith tosses to the pitcher covering the bag. And that's an out on the sacrifice. So two down. And now it's the switch inning second baseman, Michael Evans. One for three. That's in for a strike. Here's a rip to short, but he's there for the third out. No runs, no hits, no error. Base is empty, one away. And here's the catcher, Jamie Ritchie. The pitch. On the ground, right side, Evans. Low throw, and he can't take it out. Looked to me like he got on the side of the ball a little too much right there. Maybe a little too casual as well with the throwing motion. And digging in, Zach Britton. Comes a 2-2. Lays down a bunt to the right side. Smith, he's in there. Now it's the second baseman, Michael Evans. Move to first, Infante, back in on a dive. Line drive, caught! Nothing you can do about those as a hitter, even though you know that, they still drive Welcome back. We head to the bottom of the second. Here's a speed threat. Rafael Lantigua. Ground ball right side. Evans. Tosses to first. Leadoff man retired here in the second. Oh, I'm impressed with this guy's internal clock. He knew he had plenty of time to take that. Two outs, nobody on. Now the left fielder, number nine. Kicks and deals. That one sizzling on its way through to the outfield. And that keeps the inning alive. Bottom of the inning. And now the right fielder, number 54. The right fielder. Rutledge back to work. On the ground. Gathers and throws to first. 
One gone, bottom of the third inning. Now the third baseman, Tyler Keenan, struck out swinging his first time. Right-hander kicks, deals. Right side, hard hit. Tosses to first. That's the third out. Two left on. Three innings complete. We're tied. Nothing, nothing. Michael Evans getting ready to hit over one so far. Michael Evans. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Well, right now, this battery is seeing the aggressiveness of the hitters early in the count and often. So, got to be real careful that you don't give too good of a pitch, especially early in the count. Dominant performance for him today, Boo. Just two hits allowed so far, no runs across either. And he's had an answer for just about every hitter he's faced. So, I don't think this hit is going to knock him off his stride too much. So, here's the cleanup hitter, Trey Harris. Cuts and misses, it's a strikeout. Man, I really like the ability to bounce back right there after not getting the call. He probably should have gotten. He didn't let it affect his focus, and he came back with another good pitch to get him swinging. Just a weak fly ball this time. Makes the catch, and that is the third out. Of so first and second with two outs. Next to hit, number 54. He's over one. Here's a 2-1. Smoked on the ground a second. In plenty of time to first, and that is that. So it's no runs on a hit, no one time, Runner in scoring position, no outs. And here is Michael Evans. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit's probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute on the mound. Come on, Daddy, like a big dog. Right time, right time. Ah, work it ahead. And takes low for ball one. It's for a good one, huh? Here comes a pitch. Misses outside, and that's ball three. Come on, big guy, one time. Here we go. And that one is lifted in the air. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. One down. The white blue. So one out, nobody on. Here's the second baseman, Michael Evans. to center and that'll fall for a base hit so they get a man aboard with a one out single but we don't think that pitch would have been called a strike but he did such a nice job of pulling his hands tight to the body and just getting enough of the barrel on it to be hard enough back up the middle for a knock on the ground right side throw to second into center field So one out with two aboard. Now it's the DH, T.J. White. Struck out on just three pitches last time. And a four-pitch walk. Oh, this is their chance to break it open. If they don't end up winning this ball game, they're going to look back at this opportunity right here and have some regret. On the ground is short. There's one. On to first, save. So they get one, but a really nice try there. So digging in, Luis de Los Santos. And the righty deals. Ground ball left side, could be two. Infante, toss to second. Over to first, but it's offline. One out. Runner at second. And now it's going to be Michael Evans. On 
the ground right side. Fires over to first. Got him. And welcome back. All set for the bottom of the ninth. Here's the catcher, Jamie Ritchie. Here's a one-two. And he hits a ground ball right side. On to first. One out, bottom of the ninth. The center fielder, number four. Sometimes it takes just getting away from home. Guys can sort of come together, connect a little bit more than they do when they're at home with their families. And that can breed to success on the field, as we saw in this game today. Excellent win by this team. And your finals. He's gone more than a few games now without drawing a walk. Plate discipline might be something to work on. I've got minor league manager Rachel Balkovec with me. Rachel, how important is it in a player's development to work on plate discipline and drawing walks? It's absolutely vital. I mean, you're always going to see that people point to the example of somebody hit a home run with a pitch at eye level. But realistically, you're going to do better at hitting line drives, hitting the ball hard and in the air with the pitches down the middle. So you just have a better chance of success, and it's extremely important in player development. Yeah, and you know, Vlad Guerrero, the Hall of Fame outfielder, had the ability to hit pitches on the bounce, pitches that were a foot out of the zone. Most young players do not have that ability. So if you're on your way up, don't put yourself at a disadvantage by chasing a pitch that's in the opposite batter's box. Everyone, including our players, points to Vlad as, as the example of why they should be able to do that. But it, as you said, not everyone has that ability, and even players at the extremely high levels do better when they're swinging at strikes. You're out! Just about ready to go and towing the slab in this one, Jake Irvin. Chris, it's a little more common these days, but still, he's a strikeout per inning type of guy. Well, I hear you about the strikeouts. A lot more guys striking out today, but when you consider having the ability to get that strikeout, particularly when you need it, a man on third, less than two outs, situations where, yeah, maybe you're not a real high strikeout guy, but just knowing you have the swing and miss stuff in a big spot, I think it's real critical, and he's got it. That misses. Two balls, no strikes to count. Chris, with that distraction and the speedy guy at first, he's in a favorable hitter's count. Well, if nothing else, I mean, this is a great spot for a hitter to be in. And there's a foul ball. Next offering upstairs. Still just the second batter of the inning, and on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They've got him working hard out there. Late swing, fouled off. Fox, the base runner at first with one out. And he walked him. 
A uh, great back and forth and that at bat. He had to lay off some really close pitches and somehow Boogie found a way to keep the bat on his shoulder right there. I'll tell you right now, I couldn't have done it. And he'll two. He goes down looking. Oh, nice job right there. He struck him out twice. The pitch before looked like it was strike three. Doesn't get the call. Bears down. Throws another quality pitch for the strikeout. On the ground to first. Oh, look at the stop. Throw to first, and they get the out. End of one, and we're still scoreless. Two on, one out. Number 73 will hit next. Definitely wants to stay out of the double play here. Ball in the ground in the infield. Should be an inning-ending double play. Left-hand hitter waits. Swing and a slow roller. Sneaks through, base hit. Here's the throw, the tag, and he's out. But one run is in to score. Back here at the ballpark, top half of the third inning. Now at the plate, Connor Norby. Hit on the ground to the right side. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. Not in time. He's safe. Now the number two hitter, Reed Trimble. He reached out a walk his first time. Norby gets his lead at first. Nobody out. Back to the mound. Irvin to second. On to Smith. Two. Great job on the mound. Fielding his position and making a good throw to second to get the double place. And now it's the switch hitting second baseman, Michael Evans. Worked a walk in his first trip to the plate. Time called. Good eye right there. Now snap throw to first. Fox back easily. Nobody out. Runner at first. Splits the plate, and it's one and one. Just missed. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten him up a little bit so he doesn't have it. There's one. Throw off line. He's safe. And a nice job there to keep it from getting away. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Trey Harris. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Here's the 0-2. Right through there, got him. And there are two outs. So up next, T.J. White. Get your pitch, drive it. And a strike in there. Well, we call that keyholing. Even though it's right there and looks pretty good, if he doesn't love it, he's not going to swing that early in the count. Goes down looking. So it's no run. Base is empty with two away. And the batter now, Michael Evans. He's all for one. And it's fouled away. And the lefty with the 0-1. That one missed. One more, one strike. Just off the outside part of the plate. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there. And boy, umpire didn't give him the call. I bet you if he throws it again, hitter knows he's going to have to swing it. The 3-1. That's towards center. He's got it. And that is out number three. Ryan O'Hearn comes up to hit. Two, two, two. 
at 0-2 now. On the ground is short, could be two. Feed to second, that's one. On to Smith, two. Well, almost any time you roll over and sing it. Runner at first with two away. Michael Evans digs in now. And first offering is fouled off. The two ball hitter showing so much versatility, understanding the situation, gets on base with two out to bring possibly the best hitters in this lineup up to the plate in this inning. That misses the zone, and that is ball one. Right now, they're looking for something, hit hard into the gaps, give them an opportunity with two outs to score that run from first. Line drive, base hit. Makes the turn at second, heads for third. Headed for the plate. Relay throw home, and he's out. Up down, and that ends the inning. Well, I can understand why they tried to force the issue. And now, Michael Evans. He had a really nice opposite field approach in his last at bat. That misses the zone. Ball one. Big situation right here. you got some speed over there at first base. He represents the tying run. Question is, do you send him and get him in the scoring position, or do you let that batter swing and maybe put you ahead? Next one misses, and now 2-0. And there's a the ball. Home plate umpires trying to tighten things up a little bit. In the air, left field. Ball game. One nothing the final for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chomby saying so long. Here now is our final line score. First for the victorious day side. One run, four hits. No errors, they left eight men on base. For the Senators, no runs, five hits, one error, they left 20 men on base. One down, that Colin Burns the now at the plate. Colin Burns. To the right side, Evans. Whips it to first. Out number two. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now it's the second baseman, Michael Evans. That one is absolutely belted. Back there. Gone! He powers that one out to left, and it ties it up. It's 1-1. Chris, we knew this moment was coming for him soon. Yep, and it finally came. We knew it was only a matter of time before he's going to connect with one just like that. Just too good of a hitter at the plate. Well, he went up there, oh, oh, looking to do damage. I think he had his sights set on that pitch. He went and got it and circled the bases. Man at second here with two away. Michael Evans getting ready to hit. One for one so far today with a solo homer in his first at bat. If you're going to be a championship type of ball club, you've got to hit with runners in scoring position. And after last night's struggles, I'm sure these guys are chomping at the bit to have this kind of opportunity here early in this game. Bounced out to short, Burns. Sends it across the first, and they're happy to just get off the field. Then at first, and here is Michael Evans. He's already homer here in this one. First pitch, just misses. You know, this group of hitters putting together some really good at-bats in this game. There's been a lot to like with how they're approaching their chances at the plate. It looked to me like they really wanted to get to the starter early, get him out of the game. Young, over to second, onto O'Hearn. Two! I think there's always something pretty about watching a 5-4-3.
Top of the sixth inning. And now here is Shane Fontana. On the ground, right side. Gets it to first. And a quick out, number one. Two on with one out. Now, Mark Colesbury. Right back to the mound. Could be an easy two. Over to Fox. That's one. Double play. What a twin. Here's the second baseman, Michael Evans. He's already homered in this game. And there's the strike. The opportunity for a huge inning exists right here. Bases loaded, nobody out. But as a hitter, can't be over anxious. That pitcher is up against the wall. Make him come to you. You'll one. He swings and fouls one off. Hey, a strikeout, and you need a ball perhaps on the ground for a double play or get yourself a pop-up, something, but you've got to make some pitches. But if he can battle and get through this, he can earn some points. Righty to the plate. Got him swinging. 7-2 your final here today. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby. Thanks for joining us.